Canada. Shit! Let's get the hell out of here! Wait, you guys! Don't leave me! I'm coming! Random question, but why did you quit being a soldier? That is random. You don't have to tell me if you don't want to. Oh. Um, did you have any soldier friends? Any war buddies? No. Not really. Oh, okay. Huh? What we got here? Fresh meat to test our new toys. That's one. That was close. Here goes! This one's for you! There! Get him! Go on! That's it! One more shot! Stay strong, okay?
It's this way. Pretty well. Sure did. Uh. Huh? Wait a minute. Did you just? Nope. Don't worry. We'll be on the same page next time. What are you talking about? I'm sorry. Okay. The gate to Sector 7. Looks shut. How do we open it? More importantly, how about we take a break? Sound good? No. I don't have time Up for- Up there looks nice. <sighs> Come on! Time ago, I used to sell flowers here. Oh, yeah? <clears throat> so, Cloud, you were a soldier first class, right? Yeah. Weird. Really? What's weird about it? Nothing. Just that you were the same rank. Huh? As who? The first guy I ever loved. <sighs> What's his name? I probably know him.
Are you okay? Oh. Wow. Uh. Your eyes. Oh. It's because of the Mako. All soldiers have them. Yeah, I know. Sorry, I'm bumming you out. We should go. <clears throat> Gotta look forward, not back. Won't take long. <sighs> Ready. <sighs> Want to get to Sector Seven in style? This is the passageway for you. getting home and if I said I wasn't I'll go with you I thought you needed to get back <laughs> don't worry I have a backup route for emergencies and it's safer too <laughs> guess this is it then Ready? Yeah. Lost you. What's going on? Shh. I'll explain everything later. But now I'm on my way to see Don Corneo. You should head back to Seventh Heaven, meet up with the gang. But I'll be fine. You've seen how much ass I can kick? I have. <laughs> yeah! Yeah! Oh, no, you don't. You're going after her. She's a big girl. She can handle the likes of him. And worse. Uh-uh. You don't know, Corneo. It doesn't matter how strong or smart you think you are. He'll find a way to turn it against you. And where is she going to meet him? A mansion filled with his goons. Come on. Aren't you worried what might happen in there? You have to help her. <sighs> Come on! Okay. Come on, Cloud! We gotta hurry! You gave a ride to a girl earlier. Do you have any idea where she went? 
No, and if you don't need a ride, then get the hell out of here. Can't you see I'm trying to work? Can't say I can, no. What'd you say to me, you little... What's all the ruckus out here? Hmm. I don't know you. What's your story? We're looking for a girl who took one of your carriages. Can you help us find her? Depends. What do you want with this girl in here? Guess. We want to save... Save her from a life without this handsome guy. Huh? So, that's how it is, huh? Well, I get a lot of customers. Hard to keep track of them all. This girl, what's she look like? Well... Um... She's a great fighter. I'm not sure that helps. Wait a minute. You talking about Tifa? That's her. <laughs> oh, looks like someone's got a bit of a crush. Hate to break your heart, kid, but it's gonna be a long while before she sees the light of day again. What do you mean? She's a real pretty girl. Corneo's hosting another audition, and Tifa was chosen as a candidate. An audition for what? For the title of the next Mrs. Corneo. She's what he likes all rolled into one sweet package. Having scouted girls for so long, I know his taste better than my own. And considering those tastes, I can guarantee you this. She won't be walking out of that mansion anytime soon. If at all. So where can we find this Don Corneo? <laughs> what are you asking for? Thinking of raising holy hell or something? Do what you gotta, but leave me out of it. I told you what you want to know. Now take a walk. <sighs> And there goes our best lead yet. <sighs> Maybe we'll have better luck in town. Let's check it out. Welcome to Walmart, the pleasure capital of Midgar that's got everything for everybody. Couple, huh? It's all good. Play together, do your own thing, earn a little scratch on the side even. Whatever you're into, we got you. Got a special one-time limited offer. No, thank you. Come on, Cloud. Let's go. So, what kind of mischief you looking to get up to tonight? You gotta let go of your inhibitions and set yourself free! The sweet embrace of pretty ladies? Oh, that's what I need. Oh, to enter or not to enter, that is the question. Wherefore does this philosophical quandary torment me? You totally get where I'm coming from, right? I knew it! Let me guess. After you've had your fun, you fall into a spiral of shame and self-loathing. But it only lasts a moment, doesn't it? Next thing you know, you're right back here again. Huh? Got a question for me? Seen Tifa around? Tifa? My love? My light? Who are you and how do you know her? No, shut up! I don't care! Tifa's here? Why? Tell me why! Oh god, no. I did this to her, didn't I? She kept looking for me to beg me not to leave her! Snap out of it, Johnny! Your Tifa needs you! Tifa, I'm coming, baby! Who was that? Nobody you want or need to know. This is it. Come on, old man. One more. Out. 
I will go wherever my research leads me, but the success of my endeavors rests entirely upon you. Your assistance would be much appreciated. Cloud, I have come up with the most fascinating theory. Perhaps you can lend me your assistance in gathering data to test it? Cloud, I've registered a new summons battle intel request. Please, take a look. I need you to defeat the summon entity so I can complete the materia. I have to tell you that I'm grateful for all of your help thus far. I've done it! I've developed a new materia! I hope you will continue to help me gather vital information from my research. Then I invite you to ready your portable battle simulator.
strong, okay? Cloud, this is incontrovertible proof that the universe has a sense of humor. Now that you have a fun new partner in Fat Chocobo, you can work together to squash Shinra like a bug. I look forward to receiving all of your future battle intel submissions. Still can't believe burgers made from that. Welcome to Walmart's premier weapon shop. Do come again.
Check it out. Uh... I think we might have found our man. And he's a gaudy one. Yeah. Not so fast, buddy. Back it up. Got no need for pretty boys here. We're looking for someone. Let me guess. First time in Walmart, kid. Yeah? So? So people can't just walk through the Dunn's front door. Especially men. How about me, then? Can I go inside? Maybe. But you're gonna wish you didn't. You know Leslie? She's kinda cute! Homely, but cute. Excuse you? Kinda cute, it's not gonna cut it. Come on, can't you help us out? Do you have any idea what you're getting yourself into? Aerith. Seriously, Les, she's not half bad. With a little work, I bet she'd clean up real nice. Cloud, requesting permission to kill. Denied. <sighs> if you're really sure you want to join an audition, then you're gonna need to get official approval. And who can give us that? The trio. The only ones in town who are considered authorities on Corneo's particular tastes. First, there's Chocobo Sam. And then there's Madame M over at the massage parlor. Last but not least, there's the Honeybee Inn's Andrea Rodea. They're an eccentric bunch, to put it mildly. And you should know they don't recommend just any girl stupid enough to come knocking. Hmm. Duly noted. Thanks for the info. We'll be back soon. sure about this if you've got any better ideas not really so that's the way it is hmm. Tifa's been invited into the Don's estate huh but to earn such a privilege you must first win the approval of one of the trio right meaning I now know what I must do to save her stay strong Tifa help is on the way Johnny's coming baby <laughs> Not the sharpest tool in the shed, is he? Nope. I'll tell you a thousand times, got nothing for you. Now scram. Wait, hear us out. You're one of the trio, right? I want you to get me into the audition. Huh? Pretty please? Why not? Really? Sure. Next time an audition comes around, I'll put your name in the hat. Next time we'll be too late. Can't you get me into this one? You want in now? No can do, sweetheart. I already recommended Tifa, and she's got this in the bag. How can you be so sure Corneo will pick Tifa? You never know, he might pick me. Damn, you really do want in, don't you? Sure do. Then how's about we play for it? Call it, Missy. 
heads or tails? Guess right, and I'll grant you your wish. <sighs> Guess wrong, and you'll leave me in peace. Heads. Tails, you lose. <sighs> hey, don't look so glum. You're a pretty enough gal. Just not quite Corneo's cup of tea. But if only the Don will do, try convincing one of the other two. That's why it's a trio, and not just the Mio. Now skedaddle. Wait. Mind if I see that coin of yours? Trick coin. I had a hunch. That's cheating! And that's the wall market way. Lesson learned. Still cheating. Indulge your wildest fantasies. What happens here stays here. After all, baby, you're in Wall Market. That's just how we do. I guess they're closed right now? Why don't we try looking for another one of the trio? Hmm. See the sign out front? All I got is materia. Buddy. There's something downright wrong with this place. Oh, this place is full of too. I swear. supposed to go down like this. Oh, this the place? I just wanted to see Andrea. So. Curse Let me handle this. But you wait out here, like, okay? And why would I do that? No, I'm coming with. I'm not really sure that... You're a man of many talents, but talking isn't one of them. Good evening. Oh. Hey, uh. Welcome to the heart and soul of Wall Market, the Honey Bee Inn. Is there a honey boy or girl whose company you desire? Uh, we're here to see Andrea Rodea. Ah, the shining star of the Honey Bee Inn. Now, are you the one who made the appointment, sir? Can I have your name? Oh. We don't have an appointment. I see. I'm terribly sorry, sir. An appointment is required, and the earliest available slot is three years from now. Three years? All we want is five minutes. He can spare that. I need his help for the Corneo audition. Yes, well, regardless of the circumstances, you cannot meet him without an appointment. Is there really no other way? 
It is rare, but Mr. Rodea does occasionally extend invitations to individuals who catch his eye. Otherwise, I'm sorry, but there really is nothing that can be done. I guess that's that then. Oh well, let's try someone else. I'm sorry that I couldn't be of more help to you. Andrea shows transcend beauty of You bet this is gonna be amazing. I can't wait. I'm so excited, I can't breathe. Just don't forget about the special cheer. The audience is part of the course. I know why you're here. We have to help make all great shows, right? Because if you're not here, it's all I'm sorry that I couldn't be of more help to you. Alas, most of the audience can't appreciate your soul. Do you a top fighter? Huh. I thought the shows at the Honey Beam were gonna be a little more, you know, on the provocative side. Marlita's the greatest honey girl there ever was. It's an undisputed truth. Yes, it's always best to be prepared for the worst, wouldn't you agree? Quality monster insurance is more essential than ever these days. What's that? You're very Only our premium policy will do for you, sir. Keep this up. You might want to sign up for disability insurance. Like now. I can get you enrolled in a... No, no way! You've lost your marbles, man! My marbles are secure, sir. Tis you who are crazy. the two of you step right up now then what manner of massage do you desire say what is this your first time in our establishment mm -hmm. we are a hand massage parlor an excess of fatigue and tension can make even the simplest task a terrible strain it is our pleasure to relieve our patrons of that tension <laughs> and what better way to seek relief than through the skilled ministrations of a professional so now that we understand each other, what manner of massage do you desire? We're not customers. Then you are... Hoping you can help us get an invite to an audition with oh, Don... Oh, love of Say another word and I'll shove this fan right down your throat. Oh. Ugh. Ugh, this is the last thing I need. You're young and stupid, and I suppose that means you think I'll let you off easy. So, you want what? A favor? Well, here's the thing. This is a massage parlor, a respectable establishment. But if you don't require our services, then tell me! Is there any reason I shouldn't have you dragged outside and shot for wasting my valuable time? Well? Ooh. Hmm. Name? Cloud Strife. Hand. Huh? Give it to me! The strong, firm hands of a fighter, yet they possess a certain elegance and grace. Okay, Cloud. Let's see what you're made of. After that, we'll talk. So, which course will it be? Then make your way to the room in the back, and wait. Cloud? Well then, it should go without saying that you get what you pay for.
all four fingers at once, quick and to the point. <sighs> Little rough. Hmm? They can stop at any time if it's too much to handle. Try flexing the muscles. You'll feel the difference. Hmm? Loose and limber. Am I right? Actually, yeah. Hmm. How was it? It's all right, I guess. What are you doing? Flexing. Flexing. Uh, never mind. Hm. Think you'll make a habit of it? <sighs> All right then. I think I've seen everything I need to see. So, tell me what you want, and we'll take it from there. You're one of the trio, right? I want to get into Corneo's next audition. And why in the world would you want to do that? Hmm? Okay. Really? But, you cannot go dress like that. Huh? I could never send Corneo a candidate wearing such a plain-looking getup. Doing so would call my position as one of the trio into question. Is something wrong with my outfit? It's comfortable, isn't it? Cloud the fashion critic. Look, just take it outside the parlor, would you? Sorry, we'll stop. So, what should I do about the outfit? <laughs> you just leave that to me. I'll put you in a dress so fabulous, you'll look like a million gill. So long as you can afford it. How much? What I said. But don't worry. It's obvious you can't afford a dress with that kind of price tag. So listen, I have an idea. Uh. There's an underground coliseum in this town. Up for a fight, Cloud? Good. Because I'm getting you into that arena. If you win the tournament, I'll transform Aerith into a drop-dead gorgeous beauty. Is there any prize money? <laughs> yes, for the person who got you in. So. What do you say? All right. That's what I like to hear. You'll need this. They're already letting fighters inside. You should hurry. Run along. What have we gotten ourselves into? Nothing good. I wouldn't expect a fair fight in this town. Think we can win it all? That's one thing I'm definitely sure of. I appreciate the confidence, just don't get too cocky, okay? Think of top of the night. Good, call my name. Spectators only. Open the doors already. 
Everybody knows I've got the best Coliseum souvenirs around. And when I'm open for business, you can buy some. What's this? You're here to compete? <laughs> I hope you know you're cutting it really close. So, the two of you are a team? A team? No, it's just me. Yes, the two of us are a team. I need to get into that audition, but I won't let anyone else fight my battles for me. That includes you, mister. All right, team it is. Head to the waiting area down below. Down, down, down we go. So, how deep does this thing go, you think? I wonder how many people are fighting. Hey, you're not nervous, are you? Nope. Really? You're even more quiet than usual. Just trying to focus, like you should. Hey, lovebirds, over here! In the city that never sleeps, in the paradise of debauchery and sin, the pain and pleasure, where your every desire can be indulged for the right price. Who all must be a steam connoisseur of the chaos and bloodshed? We bid you the warmest of welcomes. Are you sitting comfortably? Or tonight, the most gruesome spectacle anywhere in Walmart or beyond shall be yours to witness here in the Corneo Coliseum! Tonight's grand prize is no less than one million gal, and there's only one way to get it. Brutalize your opponents, thoroughly and utterly, viciously, without mercy, until they vomit life. Only the most ruthless fighters, the savages still standing here at the end, shall claim the skill and the glory. And now, the long-awaited event in which the blessed star feet will battle for your amusement, and opponents! Warriors of every shape and size will fight to the death before your very eyes! And tonight, Corneo Tom! Wow, this place is really something. You two, wait here until it's time. <laughs> oh, <laughs> you again. Ouch, what happened to your face? I just needed a little scratch, you know. So I signed up for the preliminaries and, well, I hope you guys realize what you're getting into. I don't want to scare you, but if you can make a run for it, you should. Cloud and Aerith, your match will begin shortly. Please make your way to the gate. We're in way too deep to back out now. You two ready? Try not to get yourselves killed. Best, we welcome two fighters, a young couple no less. Talking about a bad day? This is their first.
first tournament, the bad first date, and most likely their last, inexperienced as they are, or are they? Give it up for Cloud and Eric! Bullshit. What's up with the pole? Gonna do a little dance for us, baby girl? Okay, now I'm mad. Zero one of Walmart's own, a renowned master of beasts. Will his pet make a meal of our two challengers? The power of their eyes have already been given their appetizers. Their hunger for flesh and fear is unquenchable. The demon dogs of hell, the Sanguine Stalker! Animals? Oh, first timers, huh? There's no rule that says you gotta fight man to man. We're in for a treat, ladies and gentlemen. Who will prevail in this brutal contest between man and beast? This could be over in an instant, so don't even blink. Without further ado, the fourth match of the first round begins now. Let's <laughs> 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 don't make sense. Yeah, true. But maybe it'll be better in the next match? Nah. Wouldn't bet on it. Better to expect the worst. You've got some time before your next match. Get some rest. Cloud and Aerith. Your match will begin shortly. Please make your way to the gate. That's what they call beginner's luck. But the next match won't be so easy. Ready to rock? Just remember, try not to die. For the second match in our spectacular semi-final! Fresh from their first day with death, I present the Lucky Couple! We're like unlucky for the rest of us! Give it up once again for Cloud and Eric! Couple of my ass! What the hell you two try to pull? You assholes cost me a fortune! Yeah, yeah! Their opponents, Reavers in this trapyard, thieves and killers through and through! Too criminal for common criminals, the worst of the worst! Ladies and gentlemen, check your pockets, because they may have already robbed your blind! The most contemptible son of bitches inside of Walmart market, Bex Benefits! Gentlemen, 
and would seem that there are actually eight members of Beck's badasses. Hey, that's cheating. The only rule here is that there are no rules. Yeah! If Corneo says it's okay, you gotta suck yeah! it up. Yeah! Did not hit Brandon with approval! This is ridiculous. The odds are overwhelmingly stacked against them. This could be a real bloodbath. So I implore you, ladies and gentlemen, don't look away, or you may miss the best part. The second match of the Corneo Cup semifinals begins now! Here we go. I'll show you what I can do. This one's for you! I'd get my mistress if I were you! Get him! Can you take over for me? give him a massage, you know. His palm told quite the tale. He's cheated death more than a few times. Hmm. So have half the people in this town. Anyway, we're both still alive. Call it. <sighs> there you go again. One of these days, your luck is going to run out. When I fall from grace, Maybe I'll land in your parlor once more. <clears throat> that is one mistake I will never repeat. <laughs> you gotta admit, Andy, the way he moves is totally amazing! Andy! <sighs> Next up, the big finale. Yeah. I thought you'd be happier. Just thinking about what we might face next. But you know, we've made it this far. I'm sure we can handle anything they throw at us. Cloud and Aerith, the final match will begin shortly. Please make your way to the gate. Man, you proved me wrong. You guys are pretty good. It's the final match. You good to go? I've got a lot of money riding on you two. Win it for me. Ladies and gentlemen, our time together is almost over. Tonight's thrilling Corneo Cup Filled with unprecedented upsets and drama, has only one match to go! <laughs> we know, we're just as disappointed as you are! But ladies and gentlemen, all good things must come to an end! So let's celebrate by getting so damn loud, they'll hear us up on the play! Yeah! Come on! Once more! The sweethearts who surprise us with upset after spectacular upset. 
the power couple with the boundless love for bloodshed, the champions of Madame M, Cloud, and Eric! Yeah! Come on now! Come on! You can do better than that! But definitely two of them takes up the trash with a mama vengeance! The Electric Executioners, Chocobo Sam's Champions! Cutting and sweeping! Come on! Robots? More like Shimmer armor. More like cheating! <laughs> Who will walk away with the one million kill prize? Get ready for a fight guaranteed to go down in history! The final match of the Corneo Cup begins now! rather well. I was looking forward to a little temper tantrum. Well, you bet it all on a toss. Sometimes you get burned by Lady Luck. Every coin has two sides. You're right, of course. Even if they are both the same. <laughs> Later. And now... I believe I have a prize to collect. Sorry. The madam will have to wait. The Don's demanding that we tack on one more match, it seems. What? If they win out, then you get paid in full. Now hold on just a goddamn minute! His call, not mine. <laughs> now that that's over, we can go save Tifa. So we'll head back to Madam M's, get you changed, and then it's off to Corneo's. Right. Sorry to be the bearer of bad news. But you still have one fight left. What do you mean? The crowd loved your show a little too much. People are placing hefty bets, much heftier than you can possibly imagine. Corneo's going to milk this for as much as he can. Meaning what? You face and defeat Corneo's fighter of choice, and only then will you be declared winners of the tournament. Hey, that wasn't the deal! Don't you think I know that?! Ah! 
You greedy bastard! Scum-sucking piece of shit-festering asshole! Uh... <sighs> but that's the way it is. Corneo's the one who makes the rules around here. But if you win this match, Corneo will have to accept your victory. And the crowd will make sure he does. So this is the last one? <laughs> I sure hope so. Go on now. That prize money is going to pay for your dress. I've been working here a long time, but this has never happened before. It's gonna be one hell of a match. Watching you guys fight gave me goosebumps. Hope your next match is even better than the last. Ready to kick ass? It's not even about the money anymore, man. I just want you guys to win it all. Show them what you got. Tonight's Corneo Cup has been a spectacle like no other. And we shared your disappointment, ladies and gentlemen, when we told you that it was coming to an end. But nobody felt it more keenly than one time Corneo, who has decided that a bonus match is in order! <laughs> Participating in this match will be this evening's leading lights, the dynamic duo that has crushed all competition thus far, Cloud and Eric! Buried in the bowels of the Colosseum. An unspeakable horse, long in prison, set free tonight for your entertainment! The secret star of Don Corneo's stellar stable! Enter the Hell House!
It's just... a house. That's no ordinary house. The manifestation of pure evil versus the most badass couple this side of Midgar! Have you ever seen a fight more incredible, more epic? You have not! No, sir, you have not! They'll be singing songs about tonight for generations to come! Keep your eyes glued to the action, ladies and gentlemen! The Cups fight final battle begins now! For all the battle is good! And already I can tell you the big bonus man will not get the point! Don't overdo it! I'll show you what I can do! The meanest of the means! What can they handle the horror of the hell house? I put down ice. Yes. Oh, the anger hurts. Oh, oh, that he found this house's major design. Go on. Oh, that color is dead. Get him away. The architect must have had one too many when he designed this thing. Feeling chilly? <laughs> Barriers and gentlemen, bang! Whoa! 
It's your turn. I got this. Take the lead. I'll take care of him. That'll do. in some way. What will you do? Why didn't you tell me you guys were going to kick so much ass? Can I get your autographs? There you are. I've been looking for you two. So Madam M wanted me to give you a message. She says you guys did pretty damn good and that you should swing by her shop when you're done here. Got it? I was also hoping you might be interested in a few more matches here at the Coliseum. Big events like the Corneo Cup are pretty sporadic. But there's always action if you want to get a piece. Hey, been waiting for you. So, what are you in the mood to fight? Not 
bad. Thank <laughs> you. 
feeling pretty weak. Bundle up! Sorry, but I gotta... It's a win, but still. Go on! Go on! Mind backing off a bit. Come back anytime you want to fight. Okay, choose an opponent to fight. Come back anytime you want to fight. Okay, choose an opponent to fight.
Deal with that. I'm coming! Buckle up! You okay? One more shot! Mind backing off a bit? Come back anytime you want to fight. 